Hi, this is Christy Marie Gott. Today I'm going to give you an overview of building your internet presence by having a website, a Facebook account, a Facebook page, a YouTube account, a Twitter account, and other places where you can be found on the internet. All of these various internet presences can be linked together and this enables you to share content such as videos, blog posts, and other information which then can become viral when other people share it. It continues to spread. We'll start with, you can find me at my website, Studio Media Cam, and then you can also find me on Facebook, on my Facebook site, and then the Studio Media Cam WordPress Basics Facebook page. And next, you can find me on YouTube as well as on Twitter. Additionally, you can find me at CNN's iReports and a variety of other sites on the internet as well. The concept here is to create content that is original content such as I use for my studio media cam. And the content ideally fits into a niche where there's a need. People who have questions that need to be answered or people who need a specific skill or set of directions, or if you happen to be selling material products, then there might be a niche for the specific material products that you are selling which answer someone's need. When the original content that you create is shared, then you share it to one person and that person shares it to five more people and each one of those, or maybe just several, share it to another five and it just keeps spreading. As you can see, uh, I put the share this buttons below each post and I also have the subscribe buttons and the follow us buttons on my website and on my YouTube channel uh, you'll notice that when you watch a video on YouTube there are share buttons below it and you click on the button that says share or embed this video and you'll see the Facebook share to Facebook share to Twitter, or the Google Plus One button. Now when I click that Share to Facebook, it automatically shares these videos to Facebook, which then makes them show up on the feeds of all my Facebook friends, and they share them on their Facebook pages, and so it continues to grow. And additionally, um, you provide original content, avoiding duplicate or similar content to others so that the Google search engines will find your content to be acceptable. Google's known for punishing you and pushing your content rankings down if you are keyword stuffing or publishing duplicate content or content that is simply quite similar to other people. So you'll be rewarded in your Google search engine rankings if you create your own content, make sure that it's quality content. And next, thirdly, people will appreciate that useful, original, quality content and they will link to it and having those links to your site is like a recommendation as well. This year, 
2012, at the end of a as of the end of April, the news is that Google is also paying more attention to social signals, and so in addition to keywords and links, it's becoming more and more important to have that social media viral marketing going for you and this will create traffic for your website. Thank you for joining me today for this tour of my of some of the areas where you can find my internet presence and for the for joining me to hear these tips for search engine optimization and creating traffic to your website. Happy computing and have a great day.